All right, we're here with our Bob Evans star of the game, and it is obviously Justin Germano who throws the perfect game tonight here at Syracuse. Fifth perfect game in nine innings in IL history, and uh, the first since uh, Bronson Arroyo in 2003 with Pawtucket. First of all, i got to ask you, at what point do you start thinking about the fact that you're closing in on some history? Um, you know what? You think about it the whole time, but right I mean, after three innings, was, you know, I just I put it in my own head so I don't make myself nervous. You know, when, if I get deeper into the game, and, you know, I just said, you know, whatever happened, I'm probably, you know, it's pretty de determined already what I'm going to do out there. So it's not fair it's a We've talked a lot during the course of the year when you've been here that that curveball is such, your, that's your equalizer. When that thing's going, obviously you can get anybody out. It seemed like tonight that was spot on. Yeah, it was. I um, actually made an adjustment. Probably about a few, three, four weeks ago on, on my uh, on my grip, and uh, you know I've been able to throw it a little bit harder, and it's been uh, and I've been getting a lot more swing this time. In this game tonight, it seemed like the first time through the order they had the most success against you. From the standpoint, there were a few hard hit balls. As you got into the lineup the second time and third time through, did you make any adjustments that helped you? Uh, no, I think I just kind of just kind of set in. I felt better as the game went on, and you know I got to got hand it to my defense. I mean, JD made a great play. That was a tough play right there out in the left field. It made a great throw. And, you know, I had a couple line drives that people ever hit hard, but you know, my defense was there, stayed calm, and made plays. You ever uh, had anything like this before in your career? Uh, not in my professional career. I think I threw a no hitter in high school or summer league or something like that, but. Um, this definitely uh, is at the top of the game, so my, my career games. This is a Columbus team that has been struggling here as of late, has had a tough time scoring runs. Does that in your mind when you go to the mound, knowing that the offense hasn't really been able to help the pitchers much the last few days? No, not at all. I just try to go out there and take care of what I you know, what I want to do. I just try to keep the, game, the team in the game. and you know We've been struggling, but you know, it's baseball. It's a long season. I, I know we got, we got a great offense, and you know if I can do whatever I can to keep them in the game, I know they're going to get their hits and score some runs. You've been back and forth between starting and relieving, and you get a chance now to be in this rotation on a regular basis. Do you have something to prove? Um, I don't have anything to prove. I think I just I feel more comfortable starting. I've grown to like the bullpen, but I mean my heart's always going to be starting. I like you know having the routine, the five days, and you know being able to go out there and you know, work on stuff in the bullpen and not have to work on stuff in the game out of the bullpen. And uh, like I said, you know I, I like them both, and my heart's always going to be with starting. All right, I got to ask you. I know you got a chance to keep the game ball. What else did you get there? It looks like you got the scorecard. It looks like you have a game ticket. They set you up with some things. Yeah, I got the, I got a lot of stuff. Uh, one of the Bat Boys gave me a game ticket, and you know, I got the scorecard and the lineup card and a copy of the lineup card and <laughs> and the ball, of course. When the final out was made, what goes through your mind when that thing comes to a close? Uh, holy crap! I guess would be the best thing. I just, you know, like I said, I was telling myself not to really worry about it. I mean, if they got a hit, they got a hit. It, I mean, it would be cool to throw a perfect game, but I didn't want to you know, go out there and nibble and put pressure on myself. But you know, when you get that last called strike, it's pretty cool. Needless to say, quite an accomplishment. Justin, congratulations. Thanks for taking some time with us. All right, thank you. Justin Germano, the Bob Evans star of the game. A perfect game tonight here in